We're going to uh, be activating the child abduction response team. This is uh, done as a mock exercise to try and make sure that the, the plans and procedures that, that we have uh, developed are going to be adequate for a rapid and effective response uh, to the report of an abducted or endangered child. At this point, we've had the actual abduction happen from the school grounds. The, the uh, abduct, uh, person doing the abduction and, and the, the victim uh, were brought here to, to Lane Road off the campus. Uh, his car was parked along a wooded area here. Now the, uh, he uh, loaded her into a car and left the area. Uh, and other investigative uh, personnel are responding. And they're going to report back to a, a command post that we're going to set up uh, in an area outside one of the school buildings. Mm -hmm. uh, that, uh, from that post, we'll stage, and uh, primarily investigators and canine units will begin a track uh, to hopefully this point mm -hmm. uh, and uh, see if they can identify and locate evidence uh, along the way. Uh, other physical signs such as uh, a hat or other clothing that may have been left behind that we're going to try and recover. Truly this was a cooperative effort uh, that I feel was, was a huge success. We talked earlier uh, when we talked to the media that we will learn from this and we will uh, further analyze and, and debrief on what we see that was good and what we see that we need to improve on. Improve on. 